Hey guys, this is Summon Twain here, and before I start this video, I just want to say I'm very sorry that I haven't done a video for about 11 days. That's because, uh, well, we'll just get trust changed, and don't worry, I will still make videos once in a while, and, and this is their call finds, episode 28. This is before the big Springfield Goodwill Hall in November of 2020. But this, and there, and some stuff. Stuff I'm going to show you in September of 2020. And, and yes, I went to Weber, Weber like a couple of years ago, and. Before I'm going to show you this stuff, I just want to say not one, but two shoutouts to AATC fan and Wolf Miller. I know they're, they're both Alvin and Chipmunk fans, like I am. And if you two are watching this, you're welcome. So what I got there in September of 2020 are three toys, one CD, and eight VHSs. And yeah... The one CD and eight VHS are from the the thrift store or antique store, Nancy's Fancies. So without any further ado, let's get started. Starting off with of the toys, I got these, which are fortune cookies. Well, plastic fortune cookies, I know. And what's inside? And what's inside of them? Well, let's find out and see. Oh, we have a necklace, or bracelet, friendship bracelet, and two little fortunes. Well, I'm a little too lazy to show you guys. Let me show you these. These are pastel green and blue, which I like. And also came with two fires, which is interesting. Or Cutie catcher. Right. It's pretty hard. I open this up. And here they are. And the one with the milk and cookies. Well, this one's eight. This one is very, very lucky. And I'm not sure if these lucky fortunes are still made or not. I'm not sure. Next, we have metal flower, pony, and it came with this comb. She is. And here is this thing front, back. And it also came with this. My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, Explorer Equestria pamphlet. And here it is. If you want to read this, then you can go ahead and pause it. There's the front, and here's the back. And for some reason, the two pony names are mixed up. That one's Twilight Sparkle, or Princess Twilight Sparkle, whatever you call it, in pretzel. So that is the pamphlet, or flyer. And here's the last toy. This, the Num Nums thing. Which. One sec. There we go. So here it is. It 
pretty cute. And this one has been my absolute favorite. And this spice spray right here. Hmm, it smells like it smells like either banana or birthday cake. I don't know. And this right here, which uh, smells like birthday cake or cupcake, whatever. And it came with this. And again, if you want to read this, then you can go ahead and pause it. And I got yummy sweet cakes and candy cakes. Pretty nice. Hold on. If I have to drop the camera like for like a few times, and I forgot to show you the um, oh, yeah, uh, the e. oh, yeah, uh, the receipt that I've got back in November of 2020, which, hold on a second. There we go. Here's the one. And I forgot to show you that, like, in my other Earth Thrift Hall was fine episode. So there it is. Now, to the CD. Henry Mancini, pian his piano and orchestra, the world's most beautiful melodies, romantic piano and orchestra, 1989 CD, but there is something about it. So here's the front, back, side, other side and no CD but I did find another one at the lemon and flea market which I'll show you that like later on and, and I am too lazy to show you the booklet oh well now to the VHS's here's the first VHS Raiders of the Lost L Ark 1983 VHS, but there is something about it. Excuse me. Front, back, side, the other side, top. It says coming soon to a theater near you, May 25th, 1984, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom, which plays the trailer. All that. Here's the tape with the gray sticker label. It has the black, shiny, scotch, wood, white reels. Oh, it's some markings, a bottom label, but no print date. Yeah, it's gray. And due to that shiny, scotch, black, scotch, lid, it doesn't have a weakened year code, unfortunately. Oh well. Okay, here's the next VHS. Dragonheart, 1996 VHS. Front, back, side, the other side, top. Here's a tape with the sticker label, black lid, white rails. No print date. And the week in your code is the third week of 1997. So this is an early 1997 reprint.
What's next? The Baron Sing Bears and the Trouble with the Friend. And 1989 VHS. And this is my first there's random how was home video. Oh, Baron Sing Bears VHS. Yay. Front, back, side, oh, side, top. Here's a tape with these sticker label black lid and white rails, no print date. And it's written A6 for some reason. Okay, we're halfway through. Arthur's Baby, 1997 VHS. Here's the front, back, side, all the side, top. Here's the tape with the blue sticker label, black wood, white rails, no print date. Rascal, 2002 VHS, front, back, side. Here's the tape with the blue sticker label, blue lid, white rails, and the print date is July 19th, 2002. Exactly one year after my Bed, Dumps, and Broomsticks 30th anniversary slash gold classic collection version. Two years before my Baby Da Vinci and one week after my monster sink. Oh yeah, and exactly two years and four months before my Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. And the next VHS that I've got is surprisingly rare. Pinocchio Gold Classic Collection version, late 1999 VHS, but there is something about it. Front side back here's the tape with the ink label black lid white rails this print date and, and no 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 this one has not one but two print dates one week after my i'll be home for christmas and five days after my national lapoon's christmas vacation september 12th 1999 and october 3rd 1999 Okay, so we have two VHSs left, and they're all Baby Einstein. One is common, and the other is extremely rare and valuable, which I will show you that last. So let's start off with the common. Baby Mozart 2002 VHS, front, back, side, other side, top, inside, Here's the tape with the ink label, blue lid, white rails. The print date is May 31st, 2002. Exactly two years after my dog Skip, two weeks after my baby Newton, two weeks and three days after my baby Einstein language nursery, one day before my baby Bach, one week and one day before my baby Doolittle neighborhood animals. Oh yeah, and exactly six years, two months, and six day is after my Tom and Huck. Gee, we've got only one VHS left. Uh, and yes, this is extremely rare and valuable. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. I was amazed when I found this. So here it is, the extremely rare and valuable VHS reveal in three, two, one. That's right, Baby Bach, late to 1999 VHS. Why do I call this a late to 1999 for? In a few moments, you'll see. And I have to, you know, I have to show you this in Ubby Dubby, like, why not? So, hope yours, Dubby Frabant, Sabai, Dubby Ebba Dubber Sabai, Top Up, Oven Sabai. Bubak. And it says 1999. Hmm. And of course, here is the tape. And again, it says 1999. 
And it also has the, the silver warning sticker. So here is the tip with the ink label, black lid, normal reels, some blue markings, but no print date. So when I tested the tape, you will not believe what it played. So I'm saying this again. When I tested it, wait for it, it plays early 2000. No joke, no joke at all. That's extremely strange. I'm unable to show you the footage. That's because I don't have much time and I don't want this video to be copyrighted. But the good news is, I am returning to more VHS openings, clips, and closings. So here's what I'm going to do from now on. If either a VHS opening, clip, or closing is copyrighted, then I've decided to upload them on Google Drive. If not, then they'll stay on YouTube. So that's what I'm going to do from now on. And yes, I am still doing them like once in a while. So that is it for the haul video and be sure to hit like and subscribe and this is Simon Twain signing out. See you later.